Hi there, here's Kakaku with a new ComputerCraft Turtle program for you. Um, but before we come to the program, I would like to yeah say thank to thank you to you guys uh, for all the nice comments and 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 all to all subscribers, especially as I haven't well uploaded much videos lately. And this was yeah really really motivating for me to to get started again with uh, uh, videos. So really, once more, thank you. And yeah, I, I started again to play Minecraft with the uh, new Direwolf 20 mod pack. And when I play Minecraft, I yeah use turtles. When I use turtles, I have something to to share with you. Okay, then uh, what's what program is today on the list? It's not a building program. It's a it's a more technical a support program. It's for Applied Energistics 2. For those of you who are not familiar with Applied Energistics 2, I put a link in the video description to Direwolf 20 where he sets up an AE2 system. And okay, I would say let's get going and have a look where yeah, the turtle is, where the program runs. Uh, it's it's uh, this guy here in the, in the floor. Uh, maybe a very brief uh, introduction to AE2, what, 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 what it is. It's a very powerful inventory and crafting system where you can use your yeah, patterns for, for as, as crafting recipes. And uh, there are several uh, new items in Applied Energistics 2. And uh, one thing is uh, those pure crystals and also this flux crystals, uh, they have to be yeah, grown in, in water and the turtle and the program uh, well, supports us in, in doing this. Uh, generally, uh, there are, you have to craft those quartz seeds, put them into water and after a time uh, you get back those fully grown pure crystals. And this program manages the production of those different three different types of pure crystals and also as the setup is also uh, useful for for growing the flux crystals it's also available uh, to for, for the flux crystals and generally in this me interface it puts the seeds in the turtle and the turtle manages them more or less the, the rest it puts the seeds in this water puddle puts on the, uh, the, the power for those uh, growth accelerators and every now and then it checks the growth status of the crystals and when they are ready uh, the turtle returns it back into the ME system. That's actually uh, yeah, the basic functionality and yeah, I think I show you it in detail by ordering uh, some crystals. Uh, let's take 10 of each. and also pure flux crystals and later I will also order the the non-pure flux crystals. But let's get started with those. Uh, the system puts in the turtle the, the seeds and every 60 seconds when the turtle is in idle mode it only checks every 60 seconds for new seeds and when it's ready with the 60 seconds then it will detect that there are new seeds in, in, the, in the turtle and will put it into the water block. Okay, now it realized there are new seeds. It dropped the seeds, it put on the redstone signal on. This puts on the energy for the growth accelerators and then it waits for 20 seconds. Uh, it puts on the redstone signal. You can see this by this optional redstone lamp. Uh, but more important it's, is here the, the toggle bus. The toggle bus, when it receives a uh, redstone signal, it allows energy through those uh, cables and powers those three crystal accelerators. And down here you see the, the, the seeds growing in the, in the water block. And every 20 seconds uh, the turtle sucks in three times 
and checks uh, what to do. Um, if there are new items here in the first slots, uh, then it knows, okay, there's a new crafting order. Uh, if here are growing, not mature crystals, then it returns them back into the water. If there are crystals fully grown, they will be here and the turtle returns them then into the back into the ME system. Now there are growing and growing. Uh, maybe I add also. Maybe I add also um, now the the regular flux crystals. Let's take twenty, and you'll see the materials arrive here in the in the turtle, and the turtle will put them, yeah, in the in the water block. And with the next one or two uh, iterations, it will return the flux crystals as well. So. New seeds arrived and also found growing seeds. Drop the seeds, put still the redstone signal on and wait again for 20 seconds. So the flux crystal is already done. Uh, we'll have... Okay, it's not sucked in this time, but uh, probably the, the next time. Just have to wait again 20 seconds. Yeah, all these explosions. Uh, yeah, my, my mob my mob farm is, is nearby, and uh, every now and then uh, the creepers creepers explode and, and mess up my my mob farm. That's uh, I, but because I'm here in my uh, single player world, not not creative. Oh, it's now you've seen it. Uh, the 20 crystals were ready and were returned returned fully grown crystals back into the system. And we are here nearly done. Ninety percent. Probably the next time uh, they will fully grown and then be returned in the system. It's now number number four since the last uh, new arrived seeds were put into the water. It's a, it's a counter also, uh, if the turtle is in an idle mode, you can see how long it actually runs. Okay, return fully grown crystals. Redstone signal is still on, uh, just to be on the safe side, uh, not that there are still some seeds in the, in the water block. Uh, so it runs one additional iteration and after 20 seconds uh, the turtle should, should uh, turn out the yeah, signal off. Redstone signal is off, sleeping 60 seconds. Uh, redstone lamp is off and also the growth accelerator so we don't waste any energy. Okay, that's, well, that is the, the function of the program. Um, I think I, I show you a bit more in detail the, the, the setup and also the, uh, in the program, uh, the description within the program. And yeah, and how to how to download the program? Of course, uh, it's it's here. It's the paste bin. Uh, but I showed you also in the, with the turtle. Uh, first, I press with Control and T. I terminate uh, the program, and for setting up, I put everything out of the turtle. Okay, uh, let us first delete the current program because uh, otherwise I cannot download it under the same name. Seeds. Okay, now it's done. Okay, um, Okay. how to paste bin get? Paste bin get. It's st capital X E lowercase t capital J 6 C and the program name is a, I always use the small a for uh, automated programs and a e seats connecting download complete and there it is and if we run the program um, you get information how to set it up uh, it's yeah quite some information five five pages and yeah let's get through all those five pages. Yeah, the program helps you to automate crystal production with seeds in an ME system by Applied Energistics 2. 
and is meant to be used with growth accelerators in an interface that's, that's important without those accelerators it uh, well it actually will take uh, ages for for the uh, seeds to grow uh, turtle doesn't need fuel but uh, i suggest you to, to to name the turtle and it's it's also a regular turtle without any any tools this is, is also fine uh, and ideally that i will show you this later uh, use a startup program uh, so the turtle, whenever the, you enter the, your single world or, or the, the server restarts, uh, that the turtle starts this uh, the execution of this program. Page number two. Uh, well, you've already more or less uh, seen it. Uh, what pro products uh, do you get out of it uh, from the quartz seeds, from these three types, Certus, Nether and Flux quartz, you get the respective uh, pure crystal. And also from redstone, nether quartz, and energized certus quartz, you get the flux crystals. So that's the, the products. Then third page is uh, the block setup. As you've seen, it uh, well the turtle has to face a water source. Then place an interface above the turtle. So turtle, water. Here's the ME interface. Surround water with one to three growth accelerators. Power the accelerators with cable. Here are the accelerators, the cable, and the final thing is here, the, the small gray thing here, the ME toggle bus. Include one toggle bus left or right of turtle or interface. Uh, the turtle will emit a redstone signal and you can use it either directly right or left of the turtle or even one, one block above. So it's okay if the toggle bus is in this block, in this block, in this block or the buff, uh, the block here above. This is the the block setup. Then the turtle setup, as you have already seen, uh, in the slots one, two, three, put one of each seed type. It's important that it says uh, no growth uh, in here, so so zero percent. Then in slot four, one energized surface crystal. And then the fully grown versions of the crystals in, flot, in slot 5 to, to 7. Flot, uh -huh. uh, and in slot uh, 8, uh, the not pure flux crystal. So this one. That's the turtle setup. And finally, the interface setup. Uh, you have to encode four patterns. Uh, three four for the for the seeds so that is always sand and the respective uh, uh, dust of this crystal to get the seed also a pattern for the flux crystal and put all four patterns in, in, the, in the interface those are those four things it tells the AE system uh, with one certus quartz seed you get out one pure certus quartz crystal and so on yeah, and that's that's the setup. Press enter when ready, and now, yeah, the turtle gets back to work. And as there are no no seeds in the water and no additional materials in, in the turtle inventory, it uh, goes to sleep mode for 60 seconds. And yeah, that's the setup. Um, maybe I add also how to set up the turtle with the startup program. So again, Control and T for terminate, and maybe you've already seen it. Uh, I've got here this program startup, and we can edit it to have a look into it. Startup, and actually it says, uh, uh, well, when a program is called startup, uh, the turtle will run this program every time uh, the, the the world is uh, new loaded. And then the turtle OS sleep 15, sleeps for 15 seconds. And then you've got shell.run and then the program name A, AE seeds. And then also uh, how long should one iteration, how, how long should, a, should the turtle wait for one iteration. And the default is 20 and I use also here 20 seconds. You can increase this to 30, 40 seconds uh, whatever you like uh, and also if you start the program with this parameter you won't get those five uh, description pages so that's important to 
uh, so you don't have to, to click five times to, to get the turtle going. Just put in here the parameter. Hit control and save and then control and exit and you're done. And you are with control T. I terminate the turtle and the next time uh, the, the world is loaded or I click on the turtle it will automatically start the program. First it waits 15 seconds and then it should again starting with the idle mode. Yes. Okay. I think this is everything I wanted to tell you. Um, well, I hope you find this program useful. Uh, as I said, uh, if you're not familiar with this AE2 system so far, uh, have first a look into a, uh, in an introduction video and I put there a link in the video description. Then, okay, I hope you liked the program. Remember, if you like the program or the video, end all the video as, as you want uh, to hit the like button. And well, as I have no time lapse in this video, I will finish with the flyover over my, my base. Then, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope to see you soon and bye bye. Thank you.